great joy to let the blood into God's presence. And this wonderful Tuesday morning, and each and every one of you, we got the community in the love of Christ, in the name of Christ. And we are the International Community Church, here in South Carolina, you will see. We have come here, year after year. It's a great privilege for us to be here. We receive blessing coming here, associating with our loved ones here in Kenya. And we thank uh, the Nyakaj people and surrounding, especially the Nyakaj County Hospital staff members and other floor members, who are volunteers who have come with such love, with such devotion and dedication. It's been a year in progress, preparation. It's not just doesn't happen one day. A lot of preparation has happened, number one, through prayer and through tremendous sacrifice from all sides, from Kenyan sides as well as from uh, our side in ICC USA. We welcome you again to this time of uh, medical treatment and consultation and other help. And we thank God for making this opportunity a possibility, a tremendous possibility. There's a good partnership between us, ICC, and all the people here who have come here. Some of them have come from Bordeaux, some of them have come from Nairobi, some of them have come from Migori, some of them have come from Kisumu, and we welcome them all here, and others whom I have not named. But the list is long, because all people have done each and every one their own part to make this possible yesterday. We had as many as 2,130 patients treated and also given food sacks. And we thank and praise God for the wonderful way that we can do it all together as a team. Today, there will be a challenge again, I suppose, to be in a similar manner, but let's be ready in spirit and in mind and in body. Our language, body language is very important that we leave an impression that we receive in love treat with respect each and every person. I do not would like to hear from any patient. I usually ask to check out one of the patients I just at random call them and ask them, how was the treatment, how were you treated? But we should be very careful not to ever get to hear, oh, I was, uh, some people were rude. No, we want to be very kind. They are God's children. This, if God is no respecter of persons, whether you are from USA, are uh, from any part of the world, God is in sight of God, all are equal. So we need to treat our one with the, with the love and with the respect. That's the motto of MMC, Medical Mission of Compassion. We treat them with respect and love. So sometimes you get to be too many patients, you need to be very careful how you deal with them. And some of them are urgent. We have the ambulance ready, stand by to take them and help them. So please, floor volunteers, please guide them clearly where to go. And do not waste your time standing here and there. And no cell phones, especially the medical staff, I appeal to you. When people are waiting, we would like, we will want to appeal to you not to use your cell phone. You do have your tea break in the morning and in the afternoon. You do have your lunch break, you are free, absolutely free to use your cell phone. I would not like to see a single staff, medical staff or anybody go out and then talk on cell phone cover. We do not accept them. We would send you home with the, with the gratitude, but we will immediately send you home. No matter who you are, we do not need that kind of attention. When people come, we want full attention and with, of course, with the, with the enough breaks we give you, that gives you adequate time. So may God bless, especially we want to thank all, Almighty God for giving us beautiful weather and also an environment, political environment. We do not know. God knows about tomorrow. We leave that tomorrow Wednesday in the hands of God, but we'll take one day at a time, one moment at a time, and we'll do it very well, okay? So we'll do expect more patients today to come in and let's be well prepared to meet them and help them out. Also note that at the end of the day, all the volunteers, please be very clear about picking up all the papers, how clean it was every morning that we came, that we keep the place continuously clean so that it is very good for the following day. Okay, we thank you with all our heart 
And let us now ask Pastor Janet Alma Kisia to close us with the word of prayer in Kiswahili or our Jalu. Thank you. Amen. Please hold our heads for prayer. Yes, I want to go to the house. I want to go to the house. I